her hair tied up in braids and glasses perched up on her face. Glasses perched up on her face. <clears throat> She's got her hair tied up in braids. <laughs> Taking on a big world with the mention she made, and though her plans may go awry, she's on a Oh my god! Oh my god! Yikes.
I'm doing like right now, changing the bit
Yeah. Let me turn myself up. Ha, ta, 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 ta. How am I now? Yada, ya, 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 ya. Okay. Still quiet. Oh, man. Bear with me. Okay. Hopefully this should be better. Yeah. Yeah, bye. Okay, cool. Uh, first of all, hi. <laughs> Second of all, sorry. Uh, third, bear with me. My setup has still not really changed much, which is part of why I haven't streamed in a few months. <laughs> like, outside of just being busy, just because I don't feel like dealing with my stupid internet. <laughs> but, um, yeah, hello. Thank you for everyone who's here. Um, today, we're gonna be checking out some Sage 2024 videos game. Uh, Sage, if you don't know, Sage 2024, uh, I mean, well, Sage in general, is, um, Sonic Amateur's Game Expo. Um, basically, it's just a place where a bunch of different people inspired by Sonic games, fan games, um, come. There's a lot of original projects here, too. Uh... I mean, that, that's about it. We're just gonna look at a couple of indies, a couple of fan games. It's gonna be a bunch of demos, likely. That'll probably be the main thing we'll do. We'll just do rapid fire through a couple. I did not have time to curate a selection, but um, there are a couple for sure I definitely want to check out, so I'll probably... I'll probably just start with a fan game. So uh, I guess from here, I'm just gonna hop into it. Also, if you're wondering why I'm just a floating head, instead of having a full PNG tuber body, um, my micro SD card that I had a bunch of my art stuff on <laughs> was lost, and now I am stuck as this floating head because I was able to recover this from somewhere else, so <laughs> I'm stuck as this for now. <laughs> Alright, let me see here. I guess I can just share the browser, actually. What's that? What's that? What's last meeting? Oh, you're not kid you're kidding. There's no way. Oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> thank god, yeah. Yeah, okay, whew, thank god. I'm, I'm like, I'm just so nervous because it's like every time I try to stream, it just always drops, so. Ugh. Okay, but yeah, it's a bummer, but I was able to at least recover most of the art that I had on there, which is good. Let me see here, let me, let me share the, uh, the site. Okay. So, uh, let's see. I'm gonna go through the fan games first, because, like, uh, that's the main thing I think Sage was pretty much founded for. Um, I have an indie game I don't want to check out for sure after this, so. After we check out something from here, we'll move on to that. 
A lot of good options. Hmm. I did see this. I did see this. You know what? That might be the one. That might have to be the one. I don't know. I do have one game downloaded. I, I didn't have enough time to, like, curate anything. <laughs> just because I've been so busy. But I, I, I at least wanted to, like, just stream just pretty casually. Just because... I was planning to check out these games on my own time anyway. I just figured it'd be fun to stream them. Yeah. Yeah, it's gotta be this. Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. considered how much time we're probably gonna have to wait since my CPU is being used up right now, but oh well. Oh, um, I guess it, I guess now's a good time to say it is any, um, if any of y'all have played any Sage games so far and like have any recommendations, just like literally just pop them in. I'm, I'm pretty interested. Or like if there's something that you know is there and like you want to check out then I could probably play it. I have like a bunch on like priorities, so. I forget that was a thing, yeah. Mm, I don't know if I trust that to like not kill the rest of my RAM, honestly. Cause like anytime I've tried to stream something that's in 3D, it usually does not go well, but. I could attempt... I'll try. We'll get to that a bit later, though. Hang on. Alright. Turtles thing finished downloading. Hang on here. Oh cool, File Explorer just crashed. That's huge. That's really awesome that that happened to me. I'm gonna finish extracting, so. Now we can get to the game. Da -da -da. There we go. Yep, got it. Hang on here. There we go. Why is that not showing up? Hang on. Cool mouse and keyboard.
sure to be back. Oh, I'm so glad this uses turtles and dive sprites. It's awesome. Sonic, Sonic the Hedgehog X Teenage Ninja Turtle score party. Fascinating. These are the only options. I mean, I guess it's fine, but. How's the uh, game audio? Oh, that's cute. A little Heroes on a Half Shell. Seems like it's fine, at least on my end, but uh, how's it for y'all? Just compared to balance. Okay, slightly odd. Yeah, I can turn that down. Right, okay, that makes sense. How about now? This is a pretty good, like, t test area for it, I guess, instead of probably loop. Yeah, it's pretty basic. Okay, cool, perfect. Okay, test, shift plus D, shift. Okay, move in here, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's pretty basic, yeah. Cool. Pause on levels. Cool. Ooh. I'm guessing this is gonna be like some sort of like crash purple spiral orange type deal. We'll start with Sonic. I like this is Sonic Crackers, that's funny. Oh, cool. So. Oh, okay. Cool. Great start. Okay, at least it's a reset button. Thank God. Physics-wise, it honestly doesn't feel too bad. It's like very obviously not like Genesis, but like. I don't know. I kind I kind of like it for what it is. This is very clearly some like early project, which I kind of admire. That does not work though at all. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Oh, okay, there we go. I don't even think you can jump on these. I kind of love that, like, both of these just, like, kind of give you points. Oh! Not again. Okay. I do not know if there's a way to complete this. I'm not gonna lie to you. Okay, wait, what did I do differently in order to get, like, more bounce on this spring before? I guess I could just go up here. If I don't die before the time limit runs out. Hold on. If you, like, turn around mid-air, like, literally all your momentum carries over when you redirect it, so it feels weird. Like, it feels fine when you're moving forward. When you're going back, it's less good. That's awesome. Whoa. Okay, why am I, like, all of a sudden getting <laughs> so much air hot? Like, hide off of this. Holy... What happened? <laughs> Why am I suddenly, like, jumping so far? Oh, it's because, like, my air dash is, like, always active when I'm in the air now. That's crazy. Hold up.
<laughs> Alright. I'll check out like one more as Sonic and then do two as Leo. If I can, I don't know if I can, but. Bury my shell at oh my god! Oh! I see! <laughs> the bad pipe sounds! This is awesome. This is great. <laughs> it's awesome that that noise plays all the time. Is it gonna be the Sonic team into IDW cra crossover? It's literally just gonna be Crash Purple Spiral Orange, where like they don't actually need or anything. They're just in each other's worlds the whole time, and it's a mini game collection and a comic work. I guess there's no like actual like endpoint to these levels. Which makes sense. Bury my shell at wounded. Another one? What is this music? Okay, well, this just kind of seems to be the same thing, but with like... It seems to just be like the same thing with like... <laughs> a barrel added, I guess. I, I know, I know they met in Orange and Purple, but like they barely interacted with one another. <laughs> it's like barely qualifies as a crossover. Ooh, yes! Wait, no, this is huge, actually. Yes! Forgot the sun cream. Forgot the sun cream. Forgot the sun cream. Can you actually def deflect these? Forgot the sun cream. Forgot the sun cream. Okay, I got that one. Forgot the sun cream. <laughs> Forgot the sun cream. 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 <laughs> I love how like every single one of these Forgot levels the just has like a single Forgot voice clip that they use. Forgot the sun cream. It's awesome. Forgot the sun cream. Forgot the sun cream. Oh. All right. Oh, Ready. deflect is D. I swear, like, D absolutely does, like, nothing here. <laughs> oh, hey, hey, Supa, welcome. Uh, this is Son Sonic the Hedgehog XTMNT score party. It's, a, it's like the first demo we're checking out here at Sage. Doesn't really seem to be much of an actual story. Alright. I think, I think that's enough of this one for now. This is this is cute. I respect the effort that went into it, even if it's like really still buggy and everything. I like the concept. Alright. I know exactly what which one we're gonna check out next. Um, I already have this one downloaded, so setup should be painless. This one I've I've been waiting to like show to more people for a good while now. I'm really excited. <laughs> to play this again. It's so good. Hang on. Yes. It is the pre-rendered one with the alien, yeah. Yeah, this this is definitely like what one of like my like 
favorites from what I've seen. It's really cool. There we go. This one is so cool, dude. This is Supernova. Yeah, it's so damn cool. I love the visual style. Like, that's the main thing for me right now. Like, gameplay-wise, like, so far, I'm liking what I'm seeing, but it, it definitely needs some, like, structure to it. But, like, I, it, this is already, like, an extremely promising start, for sure. All right. Maybe make this a bit bigger. I really like the physics of it so far. It's like, it, it's a very fun and like responsive game. And like, I get what it's trying to go for. It just needs like some more to like its level design to back it up. But I, I guess, <laughs> show not tell. This is Supernova. Oh yeah, all the little tutorials are really cute. Music too is really good. Like presentation in general, extremely top notch for being like this early on in development. Like I, I'm pretty sure this game only started development like this year, which is insane, frankly. I'm getting a little lag though. It's probably just because I have so much open, but. Like this, this part here, this is the only thing that still kind of confuses me. Like I'm, I'm not really sure what is being like brought to attention here. I feel like that could have been communicated better. Yeah, but no, th this thing, like even for being on keyboard, it just controls like butter. There's no gamepad support yet, but like it's fine since this is a demo. But like it feels so natural on that basis alone. It's like, when you really understand how the controls work, like, they really snap together so well. I, like, I, I figured, I figured as much that that was supposed to be, like, how she interacts with enemies, but, like, I don't feel like, I feel like I still don't, like, really get how it works entirely, right? Because it's, like, not really a traditional method of attack. I think, um... I think there is a little bit of, like, a um, description of, like, what the story's gonna be about, um, in the description of the demo. We can probably look at that after I finish. It's, like, very... But, like, I what I do remember is, like, it's very, like, kind of a love letter to just Sega Saturn stuff. If it wasn't, like, as obvious with, like, the visuals already. This is a really funny way of doing, like, an Act 1 complete. Yes! Yes! Hi, Studiopolis Act 2!
dude. One thing I do like is how, like, this enemy is, like, kind of constantly chasing you. And, like, how much tension it can add when you're, like, trying to, like, link up mu movement. In, um, in accordance to the level design. It feels, like, very free and, like, but, like, still, like, puts a little bit of pressure on you to, like, you know, play better. God, I think I think this is my favorite song from the demo so far. It's really good. Don Dammer's hit once more. Yes, I love this dolphin, dude. Ugh. Lag, 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 lag. Okay, there we go. It's fine. <laughs> I'm getting like such a better. I'm, I'm getting such a better score than like I have before on this. I think this is like really, really starting to click with me, even if I think it needs improvements. That was awesome. <laughs> I love this transition to the boss. I think you can like very much tell that like this boss was inspired by like Gunstar Heroes and the like. Come on. Come on, man. There we go. Come on. Yeah, for sure. This is like this is like a very like Gunstar Heroes boss theme. It's like one thousand percent treasure all the way. I'm glad there's like between like this and like Penny, I'm really glad that like more games are like more indie games are taking like treasure inspiration. At least like more overtly, you know. What? Oh, okay. Come on, man. Come on! Penny is so good. This is still, like, one of my favorites this year. I gotta go back to it, though, since I did a lot of, like, bug fixing and, like, improvements to it, but it's awesome. Leave me alone! Come on. Dude! Dude! There we go.
There we go. There we go. Yeah, it's like it, it like very much so like. Well, actually, no. Um, in this game, every every literally everything is pre-rendered. That's not like an actual model. But like um, yeah, it's like like the way they use like the sprite scaling and like rotation effects is very cool. Yeah, that was that was the supernova demo. It's like, it's not a lot, but like, literally, for this, like, just starting out, this is like insane. It is Balls 3D, yeah. True. True. I, I was watching a video on Penny earlier today, actually. It's, it's very interesting. Like, um,. That game's, like, art direction was also, like, very much so inspired by, like, um, kind of, like, that era of, like, early 3D where, like, things were made out of, like, very simple shapes and, like, you know, like, <laughs> very simple, like, orbs and stuff. It's, like, you know, kind of also just sort of share, share some DNA with, like, this game, I guess, in a way. It's very fascinating. Wait for the music to play out. Team. Let's see. I'm gonna look third for another game. How this is playing. Uh, let's see. I'll go for another fan game, I think. Maybe not a Sonic one, though. Ooh, yeah, you know what? Actually, there was one I did want to check out. Ooh, there's two. <sighs> I wonder. You know what? Yeah, I'll, I'll start with... I'll start with this. I think this should be interesting. Let me see. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, I gotta check this out. Oh yeah, that's right. There there was there was a whole town Mario homage. I'm interested. Um honestly, like I'm I'm not as interested as like <laughs> actually, you know what, yeah, I I think I am pretty interested in that, actually. I might be one of the ones we do. But um I know the one we're gonna do now. I'm gonna download it. It's gotta take a second. Do, 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 do. said that. Patrick Squidward, Sandy Spongebob, Patrick Squidward, Sandy Spongebob, Patrick Squidward, Sandy Boom. Yeah, the Pizza Tower one's definitely gonna be on here. I think I think that's gonna be the next indie 
Well, actually, no, that counts as a fan game, technically, now. It's weird to think about. But, um, yeah, that'll be the next fan game we do, for sure. That'll be up after this. Sounds a little loud to me, so I'll probably turn it down in a sec. One second. This is Super Mario Land 2 plus Wario's Quan Con uh, Conquest, but the uh, demo. It's pretty interesting. So this is basically like a fan remake of Mario Land 2, I think, plus a an original campaign with Mario, which is a pretty fun idea. I'm assuming this is after the events of Mario Land 1, like what we're seeing right now on screen, which is cute. How's getting Mario for this? Does it need to be turned down? I assume so. That's pretty good. I like this lead into the main theme. <laughs> My head is blocking Mario's name. Okay, yeah. I figured so. Or it's not working. Oh, hang on. It will not let me. Yeah, whatever. I could probably just do it through here. Oh. filtering off. There we go. 
There we go. I'm sorry I'm like so slow to like set up every game by the way. I just I do not have a stream deck. See what the back one is. Ugh. I don't know what these are called. I don't know here. <laughs> the Alt V and the Alt V and FPS display are blocking the back button. There we go. Oh, looks like we gotta unlock Warriors Conquest. Multiplayer. Okay. Let's see. I love that this is Mario World style, that's neat. How, how do I how do I hide this? Really? Clips. Okay, so control speed up. Interesting. Wait, so what activates the spin jump? Oh, I see, it's like actual Mario World 2. That's cool. So you can just hold up and um, jump to spin jump. Just what I needed. <laughs> That's cute. I kind of like the idea of like an advanced version of like Mario Land One and Two and Three because that's a mainline Mario game, and no one can refute me otherwise. <laughs> Hi, Toad. Yahoo! <laughs> this is really cool. I, I love how that they're adding like little cutscenes and everything. This is this is really cool. I see there's a combo system like Mario Wonder. <laughs> Why is that gonna be your first time chat, Plasmo? You can't eat every funny creature you see on the screen. It's just not feasible. It simply is not. I kinda don't like controlling where the jump button is. I mean the uh, run button is, but it's fine. Like a chit monkey could fit many a creature. I mean, I'm not really saying that for your sake so much as the small creatures, but that's fair enough, I guess. Go off. Ugh. I'm like <laughs> looking between OBS and the game. Let's go! 
Hit the bell, but it actually gotcha. do it. There we go. There's the mushroom. Come on. Come on. There it is. Just what I needed. Hyper Muteki Gamer Mario. True, 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 true. feel pretty good, by the way, in case you're wondering. Got my- oh, okay. Well, it's a bit harder then. There we go. A casino? Oh, right, yeah. I forgot the gambling minigame. That's really cool. It's very fun so far. What is this? Hunt and search. levels. Interesting. Where are we going? Oh, oh. There's a lot to do with this one, so I'll probably check out a couple levels before leaving. That's cool, this is Sonic Adventure 1 mission mode. That's huge. Oh, it's cool that there's music too. That's awesome, wait. Where are they else? Where are the other, like, four? That's easy. Let's go. Oh, golden, that's funny. Should have gotten another. I'm a fool. Whatever, it's fine. No, never mind, I'm a fool. It's over. I'm washed. No! Oh! Damn. <laughs> like, my, my brain registered the, t t the Tataka song, but, like, I, I just... Did not like acknowledge it at all, I think. That's funny. This all being one person is like super impressive so far. This is kinda crazy. There we go. Music disc. I didn't see that before. What is this? Oh, I see. I, I couldn't choose the other one. 
How does I leave? I'm trying to figure out. There we go. To exit this menu. These do seem like original arrangements, like, they're all very much so in the same style of I mean, arrangement style. Should have clarified. Oh, I kind of wonder if the cutscene plays if you try to go to the castle. Is there a way to get there? Yes, you can go with the Mario statue. Not a bunch of levels available. I'll check out one more, but first I want to check out some of the Luigi <laughs> Mario All Stars Luigi specifically. Yes, it's the theme. Yeah, this this has got to be in these are gonna have to be like original arrangements. Oh, that's cute. It's using the Mario Land Two theme instead of like the usual casino theme. That's awesome. Hi, Izzy. Oh, cool. You can just you can just buy this. Oh, yeah. That's that's good. That's pretty funny. Hot options. There's like so much here. This, this is a little crazy. What? What? Oh my god? Dude. Oh my lord. <laughs> Ice flower? Wall jump. Reserve item, hard mode. Oh my god. Can I use any of these? feel like it, but... Oh, I see. These are what the silver coins are for. That's cool. No, I, I don't think they're, like, badges. They're, like, they're, they're like literally just game modifiers. Like... I just assume, like, it's, like, you can toggle all of these at once, because, like, I can't imagine why some of these aren't, like, can't, couldn't, like, overlap. But that's crazy. The one behind me is, um, secret. Doesn't say what it is, but it's insane. Also, yes, I have the carrot. Huge. One of my favorite power ups. What's this pinball? Hmm. Guess I can't use that. And I guess this is music. Yes! Yes! Mario Maker 2 Dance Right. This is this is a little like insane for how much is here. Like I'm kinda in awe. I'll check a shop one more time before leaving. I think want the green fit, but I don't have enough. Cards. Okay. Oh, I see. So that's like the actual gambling. Alright, we'll check out one more level. Goomba Rumble. I guess True Zone's the only area you can visit. It's like where most of the main levels are. But I do want to see what this is about. Oh. 
Oh, right, this auto-scroller. Oh, it's cool that there's, like, a different theme for the auto-scroller. That's awesome. Oh, yeah, true, Macrozone is available. It's a fun one. I'll probably do that on my own time, though. I kind of want to move on to the next game after this. Oh my god, you're right. That's fu that's really good. It's a good detail. Wario did this. Fucked up. Ugh. I was not paying attention for a second. I was looking back at the chat. Okay. Cool. You know what? We'll give an actual level a shot. Why not? I'm gonna macro zone because that's like one of my favorites. Legendary. Oh, that's funny. I guess that's the missions. Okay. Let's start here. Oh my! Oh my wacky workbench. Actually, no, I guess this is a Titanic monitor. What I needed. This looks really cool. I love the background here. This is like such an upgrade for the original. This is good as that, as that already looks. I assume so. <laughs> Probably not in this demo, but it'd be funny. Oh, cool. You just press once to grab, once to throw. That's nice. It's, it's pretty fun! I'll say ice play. What I needed. It like it controls pretty well. Like it's a little gotcha. floaty, but like it, it feels accurate to the way Mario Land 2 does. I think probably. This is like still pretty early on, like all by one guy. So it's like it's extremely impressive, and it's pretty fun in general. I think like the only real gripe I have is that like the music's a little dinky, but like there's so much here. So it's kind of insane, like how much has been added to Mario Land 2. Okay. I wouldn't go through the whole level, but like, Mario Land 2 levels are long, and I kind of want to move on to the next thing, but that, that was really good. That might just be, like, because I don't have V-Sync on, probably. Like, I can imagine. It, it does look a little laggy. Okay. That was the end of the level. That's good. Alright. I'll go back to the title screen, now. Unless this just quits straight out. Yeah, okay, now it's just here. So you can't play Warriors Conquest yet, that's unfortunate. Maybe you have to beat all the levels of the demo. Super, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Oh, I just realized I don't have audio for um alerts on. One sec. Uh yeah, you know what, it's fine. Oh, yeah, that's why. I, I just don't have monitor and output on. That's why. There we go. Alright. I 
continue to look at Wario's awesome screen while I look for the next game. It was another fan game, so do another indie next. There's a couple of good options here. Actually, you know what? I'll exit out of it and we'll just play music. This loop is driving me a little crazy, I'm not gonna lie. Hold up. Alright. share Chrome again, too. There we go. Ooh, Xenogun- right, I forgot there was a Xenogunner sequel. I have that game on itch, but I haven't played it yet, but it's cool as getting a sequel. Ooh, vocalist. Ooh, I might have to be the one. I was sad this- I, I was sad this game's kickstarted and happened. Tori, Tech Pack, that's another good one. I want to check out. I, like, I honestly think that I look forward to Sage more for, like, the indies now than I do, like, the fan games, like, pretty easily. It's like, there's just, there's just so much, like, cool stuff every year. I kind of wish you could see, like, more, like, comprehensive overviews from this one. Garbage Girl Louise, that's another one. Super Freaks is interesting. It had a guest level in Bun and Gun. Interesting. Let me see that one. Super Freaks. Yeah, there we go. I see it. Two, three, four Super Freaks games. That's that's a little crazy. I'm interested. I'm probably going to later though. I feel, I feel like I wouldn't do justice by, like, just playing one of these, maybe. Hmm. I think... I think I'll go vocalist. Yeah, sure, that whatever, <laughs> I guess. Oh, damn it. Uh. 
Hi, VOD viewers. Hold up. Okay, hello, hi. Alright. Next thing is also downloaded. Ugh. I, I, I really gotta get, like... I already have a Wi-Fi extender, but, like... It's either extremely good and well-connected, or, like, it just cuts out randomly. It's it's the worst. Even when I use an Ethernet cable. I, I've gotta, like, get a different Wi-Fi situation going. This is dreadful. Uh, I looks like remember to record my VOD for once, but... Ugh. Uh, yeah. It is what it is. Alright. Alright, got the next one up, though. Oh, hang on, I gotta extract first. Starting on this monitor. Hang on. Started up and immediately crashed. Not a good sign. Oh, uh, please. I want to play a video game. Wait, there we go.
Okay, this, this one's... This one's rendering a little weirdly. Uh, oh, shoot, there's story stuff. Oh, I don't want to miss this. Oh, there we go. I see. There we go. Perfect. This one seems a little loud. I'll turn it down in a second. This is, a. Uh, this one is voiceless. This the demo. This one I had a Kickstarter earlier this year. I've been wanting to play this so bad, it looks incredible. Okay, now I'm on here. Here we go. I missed some of that intro. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna rewatch that. I think the plot of this game is that um, some girl had her voice stolen and she has to get it back. Just fun. Okay, cool. How's audio? I'm gonna keep that at 60. Thank you. Maybe if I reopen it, then, um, perhaps it'll probably open properly now. Hang on. One sec. But yeah, already looking gorgeous. Really smooth animation. Sorry, is my mic picking, picking up any, like, feedback from anyone else? Just here, like a little bit, on my end. Okay. I just moved my phone away from my computer, so maybe that'll help. Save the settings. One second. There we go. All right, now I can watch the cutscene. Yay. Oh, yes, I love it when games do this. I love it when, like, a song, the song that's playing just pops up and it kicks in. away from her.
a really good intro. <laughs> Oh yeah, there's multiple playable characters, I forgot. What is this? Oh, cool. That's cute. I'll start with Karu. She's just the main character. First door for general movement, second for character specific. Okay. Seems pretty basic. Ooh. Okay. I'm already feeling this a little. Checkpoints if you die, if you teleport. If you die, you do teleport about like back to the last one you touch. Ooh, this is already really nice. I'm already feeling this a lot. So you press it down and so you just dash diagonally down. Off B to cancel any action to a trip. Just down to trip down. It's interesting. Oh, I see. Tripping too many times in the air will make you lose points. It'll also make you able to perform any actions while falling. So, stick to walls that have vines on them. Simply touch a wall with lines to slide on it. Press X to wall jump. Some areas might be blocked by movement blocks. Press C to stop. I love how many different movement options are tied to this. <laughs> they brought back. They brought tripping back? Why does Sakura hate the Smash community? Soul's gone, dude. So what is this? Jumping on one of these orange platforms to get the big boost. Okay. Cool. Run on a rail so people like jumping on it. Tricks with space. Okay, cool. Down by holding it down. Not a, are you kidding? Back, maybe. Uh. Uh, 
Hello? Okay, cool. We're back. Cool. Interesting. Whoa! <laughs> cool. Thanks, Delta and Explosion. Slush game makes an explosion. Every oh, cool. There's an S rank in every level. Dying or tripping twice in the air will deduct points for your may also have unique units. Arrow shows up above your shroud. Okay, I see. Interesting. Iron takes you to the level. What point you lose? Yeah. Dying also affects the grace. First death, the dog's a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My shots have hard difficulty. Mm hmm. I'm just now noticing the HUD that shows you, like, what you have available, that's cool. Oh, interesting. This doesn't look, um... I don't think downward dash counts against either of your dashes. Cool. Which is cool. Karu is so, so cool she doesn't need any extra abilities to get the job done. Everything you need to know about Karu is on the regular tutorial. Cool. Play. So there's no story mode yet, I guess. I'm not doing hard. I guess it's just one level for now, so. Okay, cool. Two levels. Neat. Well, so we'll probably just do this and then finish. Special abilities are for squares. This may be true. This is why Mario's so awesome. This is really fun already. I'm, I'm loving this all a lot. I know, um, I know Mad Red Dad plays similar, I mean, Mad Red Dead <laughs> plays similar to this. Exposition. <laughs> oh, I love her design.
Okay, wait. There we go. That is kind of a Bobby S squeak, I agree. True, happy birthday, Bobby! Who's Will the Real Yoko's dog? Awesomest guy ever. Nothing else happened today that's important. Besides Lego Star Wars 2 getting the shelves. Nothing else besides that. Nice. S rank. That's pretty straightforward. That was really fun. I, I I enjoyed that a lot. Oh, true Mario Maker did come out today. I forgot. That's true. God, that was that. That's almost a decade now. No P rank. True. True. I'm lost. Washers, I'm sorry you have to sit through all of this to watch gameplay footage. This sucks so bad. Uh, come on, man. Okay, well, I mean, whatever, I guess, sure. Okay, we're back. Bro, I hate Verizon so much, it's actually unreal. God, you lose so much from there.
still got an S rank even after dying, that's crazy. I probably would have gotten S plus then, if I didn't fail that. That was really fun. I adored that. Awesome bird also. I am not doing hard mode right now. But I am tempted. There's like so many characters. It's, well, I mean, there's just three, but still. I think you're supposed to get more as the game goes on. Which is crazy if so. That was really fun. I liked that a lot. It's peeing. That was really good. I, I think that's definitely one of my favorites so far. I, I'm really glad that they're still going to develop this game because I'm looking forward to it a lot. Again, that was voiceless. That was really neat. Alright. Um... I'll do one more fan game, and then one more indie, I think, before I call it for the night. I know what fan game I'm gonna do. Hang on. So I'll, so I'll like download this, I'm gonna try and uh, set something up. I some, some computer settings. Ooh, Sonic Momentum 2. Oh yeah, let me show, um... Let me show uh, Chrome again. Sonic Momentum, that's, a, that's another fan game that I'm looking forward to, but that's not the one ready to play. Where is it? There it is. Yes. Pizza Tower plus Team Junior. That's funny. That's a good dev name. But th this is Pizza Power. Uh, Pizza Tower plus. I I, I think. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure, but um, at the very least, this is a. I I don't know if it's Pizza Tower. 2019 plus Pizza Tower plus 2019 Sage demo, whatever. This is based on the Pizza Tower 2019 Sage demo, um, the official one, where um, there they were just a bunch of earlier levels um, from, from the game, just kind of thrown together in like one of the proofs of concepts. This is like basically what a year or so after it started development. This is how I first played Pizza Tower. Um, at least one of the demos for the first time. So that was always a really cool experience to me. And I, I played this specific demo so much. So I'm very interested to see like what's different here. I don't know if this is going to be like a full project that like expands outside of this later on or something. Or if it's just kind of supposed to be like a self-contained fan experience. But like either way, this this looks really cool. Like a lot of this this stuff here is like reanimated like entirely. So I'm I'm very interested to see what this is. What this entails, brother. Mm -hmm. That was a fast download.
There it is. Yeah, it's extracting it now. Let me do something real quick. I'm, I'm gonna switch my monitors up a bit, just so that way it'll start on the one I'm actually using, and not like my laptop screen. One second. Quick loading, too. <laughs> okay, cool, there is gamepad support. Yes, huge, 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 huge. Awesome crash spin sound effect also. We'll start. One sec here. Um. Oh yeah, I gotta pair my controller. Hold on a second. There we go. Yep. It should be really interesting. Oh, let me... I'm gonna I'm gonna full screen this in a second. Yeah, it's a Pizza Tower. It's Pizza Tower 19 plus Sage demo. So this is a recreation of the. <laughs> That's awesome. That's great. It's an awesome intro. But um, yeah, this is Pizza Tower 19 Plus. This is a basically a recreation and like I guess sort of reimagining of the Sage demo, which is pretty fascinating. I miss this type of menu. <laughs> Stream over already. True, true. Alright, hang on real quick. There we go. Uh, turn on the resolution a bit. Oh, that looks not great. Oof. It's running a little. It's chugging a little slow, yeah. Does, uh, does audio need to be turned down too? What are you thinking? Okay. Cool, cool. I even like redrew the backgrounds for this, I think. That's crazy. 
Yeah, they did. I don't usually play Pizza Tower with like a switch controller, but I mean not a, not a switch controller, a um, pro controller. But um, I kind of have no other choice right now because my Saturn controller cannot be plugged into my computer, and my SNES controller's dead. But this should be fine. I'll probably just use D-pad. Yeah, everything here from the final game seems to be like intact, interestingly. Instead of like the sage movement. Oh, yes, they brought back the manual! Oh my god. Yes! Hi, Snack. Makes pizza and runs for Mascot of Snick Soft. <laughs> okay, it's funny that he's going back. <laughs> Oh, that's cute. It's cool that he actually wants to go there. Ha! That's that's funny. That's really good. That's a really like clever way of like contextualizing this. <laughs> that's really good. And they redrew like everything. Hi, Joel. On oh, no break dance, though, unfortunate. Some really good taunts already. <laughs> one of them was just his idol. Wait, no, one one of them was just like the normal piece of tower idol. It's funny. This is really good already. I love how much like effort has gone into this just from the get-go. It's, it's a little crazy. No, that's Kevin. <laughs> I would kind of want to see this like be a mod of the full game or like. You know, a separate, like, fan game. That'd be really neat. Like, this seems to be doing a little differently. I forgot about this. Yes! The TV directions. <laughs> Thanks, Star Fox. running animation. I'm honestly kind of surprised I didn't bring back the little P meter thing from the Sage demo. That would fun. I'm so 
sorry, I'm skipping all this tutorial. Tutorial, John. What is the thing? Is this a John? Is that the implication here? Editions. Whoa! Hello. Pizza, this is Pizza Tower 19 plus Sage Demo. Ooh, this music. Ice Snake. Ooh. Oh my god. <laughs> That's awesome. This is really good. I like the water cooler. Okay, again, en entrance. Tip. These are just some of the ones from, uh, <laughs> from the actual game, just renamed. Some of these seem to be different, though. Interesting. I probably won't go for everything, anything, but I'll play... Let's see. One sauce. Indeed, those are, those are all the games I've played so far. Uh, the Mario Land 2 remake is called Mario Land Super Mario Land 2 Plus Warriors Conquest. That one was a pretty interesting one. What's this guy? Is this Stick? I assume this is Stick. I forgot about pizza coins. That was a mechanic in older versions. Badges. Ooh, ooh. Wait, hold up. Wait, no. I'm in. I'm in. That's huge. Yeah, I'm. I'm, I'm totally into that. That's awesome. That's huge. I'm guessing that's a boss fight. What? What is this? It's gotta be. Interesting. I'll probably just, depending on how long these are, like, considering Pizza Tower levels are usually, like, decently long, I'll probably only do, like, two of these here. But, this is really cool. Ha! <laughs> that's, okay, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. I love this. 
<laughs> Snotty! I'm not killing you ever. <laughs> no! Uh, what? Supo, what's wrong with you? Bant, bant, bant. Deleting that message right now. I can't even do that on Twitch. Whatever. I'll ban you later. Even the fork and knife animations, oh my god. Oh man, the lag on this is hurting. But on the top it's got it different animations. Wait, no, can't let up to be right. Die. The fork knife must die. This is mostly the same so far. In terms of layout. <sighs> Forgot what I mapped it to! Damn it! Okay. Oh, they even brought back the old, like. The old way the, com the combo used to show up. That's awesome. S satire and irony. You can't just say something like that, even as a joke. It's, like, insensitive. What's wrong with you? The screams. I wonder. Okay. Oh, you know what? I just realized what that last level probably is. It's a Snick Challenge. It's gotta be. This is so good. Pizza Mari! What is... Oh! Oh, you use your points! Interesting. dialogue is really good. I'm sad they didn't have that in the final game. Yeah, no shotgun, I was gonna say. I'm guessing, like, anything that's, like, a transformation in the final game. That transition, holy... I'm, I'm kind of, like, in awe of this. Oh, wow, they even did the old entrance secret song. The combo meter is changing? Like the face on it? It's crazy. Oh, the combo has heat meter? Oh god. I don't think I've ever played any of the builds with heat meter in it, that's crazy. God, even the timer is different. This is like, I'm, I'm kind of like in awe of just like how much has been changed here. But like, it still feels so fresh. And like right at home. I don't know if this does become a full thing. I'm, I'm interested to see where this goes. Just like a weird, like, alternate take on Pizza Tower. Oh god, 
God, this lag, dude. Oh, I love the screen tilt. Dude, what the hell? This is awesome. <laughs> hey, wait, no, I see you. Get over here. <laughs> the secret face. That's awesome. They even probably like, like the Super Tawn having like the spread out effects. Yes! This rolls, dude. Did we miss the door? I swear I've not seen it yet. God, the screen tilt like really adds to like the feeling of the whole thing collapsing. No! Oh, it's almost there. Whatever, clap two. And never mind. The last enemy, dude. Snick has something to say. start already like that that was that was a great showcase you know what I don't think I'm gonna go for pizza escape I'll go for one of the other two mm. blood sauce was always hell so I'm, I'm kind of like like especially in the original sage version so I'm too interested to see what this will be like Leaving you alone. Get out of my way. Stop putting them in every level. It's evil. Yes, it's the old version, too. I always love the sample in this version way more than the final. The, uh, the mashup I made on my YouTube channel, um, of, like, the song in, um, uh, Mirror Never Lies, I, I used, like, a mix of, like, both the old and the new versions, because I like the old version, like, way too much to, like, not use it. <laughs> I got the old screen, too, it's great. This is such, like, a neat, like, little love letter to, like, Pizza Tower and like, old builds and everything. I, I love it. It's really cool. Like, not even just the Sage demo. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. I love the little set dressing on, like, the secret areas.
<laughs> Come on. Come on. Go. This is definitely feeling a bit more like old blood sauce. I'm feeling the effects now. Yes, this section. I saw like pizza heads facing the background. Scary. Hello. What is this? Is, is it just a shield? Yeah, it is. Not worth. Really good time to scream. Secret treasure. Blue? Purple pepperoni? What? What the end of world? That's good. That's a, that's a really fun secret. Yeah, I think I have enough. I don't know if I have enough for him now, but I, I can try to see after this level, yeah. I do want to check one of those out. Oh god, heat. Oh, I see. The heat meter's increasing. That's why those enemies are probably different. Not again. Oh, it's always this part. I've got, like, muscle memory from Fight on Blood Sauce. Do this lag. Oh. It's like the only real issue I have with this. I don't, I don't know if it's my computer, just considering how kind of much RAM I'm probably using. Or like. Or what, but. Ooh, it's. It's chunky. Nice. 
dude. There's no way. There we Again. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's probably it's probably just my computer then. It's weird. And I guess it's because of all the visual effects. It's unfortunate. Snotty in level every level is kind of funny. Yeah. Uh, what's this guy's deal? Kung Fu. Ah. Yes! The move box. Replaces my time? Interesting. Hm. That's fascinating. Yeah. I feel like it's worth it. How do I turn on badges? Hmm. How do we equip it? Oh, you get a badge option when you enter. Okay. Um. We'll do a little bit of pizza escape, not the whole thing. This pack? Yes! Nice. Oh, that's really good. I, that, that was always one of my favorite moves in the um, older builds. Like, this thing is like insane as a movement option. I don't like how every level still like maintains the same, the same like design philosophy as the um, as the original, so like just kind of puts their own spin on it in different ways. Oh my god! You can cancel that by like by like diving. Oh, come on! Oh, right. Taunt. Okay. Oh, that's neat. Some toppings up here when you get it. I'm glad Cold Spaghetti's here. Or is this just spaghetti? That's right, this is this is just spaghetti, not cold spaghetti. Wait, 
I do want to see one of the secrets here. There we go. Okay, this one's the same. But similar. I think, I'm, I think that's it for now for this, but this is really cool. I think I'm just some sneak dialogue too. We go over there. <laughs> it's just how like it is in the game industry. I just realized he does a little choppy animation. Keep hitting it. It's funny. Alright. Is there an option to leave? Yeah, there is. Alright. I think we're gonna do one more fan. Or, I mean, not, not fan game, but one more indie game. And uh, that'll be it. Oh, I see. There we go. All right. Let me see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. here someone okay I hope not please actually you know what I, I'd be okay with that song honestly I just don't like that show scary thought of Sonic Underground being plastered on my timeline day after day So a lot of good options. I kind of want to do Tori. Oh yeah, Garbage Girl Louise, that's true. <sighs> that might be it. I don't know. A couple of good options. Uh... Yeah. That'll be the one. It is, it is, I mean, that's basically what it is. It's a hub for, like, other small, <laughs> like, just indie creations. I really love how it looks this year. It's very, it's very flashy. I love the whole Sonic Rush aesthetic they got going on. I guess should probably show like the main menu actually before we finish off. Looks really nice. Like this. Mwah. Beautiful. Love all the art they did for this. I mean. Uh, yeah, main screen is definitely the highlight here. I, I think that's probably the most flashy. 
I mean, I, I think it serves its purpose. Like, like you know, the game selection screen. It's, it's always looked like this, which I'm fine with. I kind of wish there was, like, more... I, I kind of wish, like, every site had, like... I mean, every game had, like, a little mini page in, like, its description, and then just, like, a link to its download here. I feel like that would work better. Huge. Congrats on Vivian YouTube. Answer this 1980s Americana themed obstacle course platformer. Save your pet, pet raccoon from the twisted mole cult. Awesome. Yeah. No, I, I mean, like, like you know, all the stuff that's, like, basically on here already. Just, like, or at least, like, a couple of screenshots and, like, the trailer and stuff. I kind of wish that was the stuff they'd do, like, display. I, I guess I would kind of defeat the purpose of uploading everything to Sonic fan games hacking. I mean, Sonic fan games head, headquarters, well, well, uh, So let's see. Gamepad support. Alright. This is Garbage Girl Luis. I've been looking at this one for a little bit. Looks pretty cool. Audio already sounds pretty good. This is already so smooth, oh my god. This is awesome. <laughs> Alright. I guess you just hop straight in. <laughs> That's really good. Okay, it's like crash. That's cool. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I see. Holy. 
That's crazy. I think so, from the art of seed. here. What? P Street? That's crazy. Oh, and there's a ground found. I see. Oh no? The train. Interesting. This is. Oh! Cool. I don't understand. How this works. Is there like is there like X dot bugs? That's awesome. That's pretty neat. That's a, that's a cool like twist on the Mario formula. Oh what? 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 Why why is it just moving left? Help. It's stuck moving left. Ugh. Okay, it's fine now, I guess. Hippy? <laughs> what, what are you talking about? What? Oh, the, 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 the left glitch. True. True. True, phones are cool. <laughs> it's awesome that like we have only seen humans up to this point and then there's just a giant bear. It's awesome. God, the sound design of this is really good too. Oh, yeah, I've heard, I've heard of Rage, yeah. I don't usually check for Rage out, but it's funny. Well, they do it, like, literally every year. Uh, 
Oh, okay, I see. go crazy on game head like I, I can already tell like there's so much like potential to like link stuff together here in terms of movement Yeah, the role is really nice. It, it, it feels so just... Oh, captivating. It's great. Nice. I love the 2D art. God, it looks so good. I've been thinking, like, I, I didn't know it was possible to, like, kind of just mix, like, actual 2D art and, like, pixel art like that. I've been thinking about doing something like that. It's really neat. That's pretty fun. Oh, I see. Oh my god, it's TMT1 NES. Yeah. I'll do this, and um, I think I'll call it a night after. That's pretty funny. Go. Go, 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 go. How are you this fast? Is he dressed like Wes Weasley? Wait, no, now I gotta see it. Not really. Okay, that's funny that she gets tripped up by him too. That's, good. that's, pretty, that's a good gag. Stop, 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 stop. I haven't heard the original song, but like, it's possible it's just like took heavy inspiration from it instead. But, eh. all creation in a nutshell. Oh, I see. 
She's using P speed, that's why. I feel like P speed like barely builds though. It's a little annoying. Alright, one more time. Oh! This is a nice fall menu. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm think. That's what I was thinking. She this fast, bro. Sheesh. And now I got it. Shut up. Ah! Man. Damn. Alright. That'll probably be it. But that's fun. This is really cool. How many levels are in this? I guess it's just these three. Wait. Maybe not. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, yeah, I guess so. Still, that's pretty cool. This is awesome. What's this level? Metro Labyrinth. That's neat. Awesome. That was fun. I kind of wish I could check out more. And like, I probably could if I like queued things up in advance, but I didn't really get a chance to. Uh, I mean, yeah. I guess for now, um, that's pretty much it. I'll probably have the VOD for this up on the YouTube, like, I don't know, a couple days from now, maybe. Uh, go check, I'll probably put all the, um, all the games I played in the description of that also. But, uh, yeah. This was really fun. Go check out Sage, go play everyone's games. That's a great sentence. Yeah. It's awesome. But, um, yeah, go check out Sage. Go play all these awesome creative projects. There's so much cool stuff here. Oh, shoot, I almost forgot. There was one game I really for I forgot it was going to be here that I really wanted to check out. Hang on. One sec. Buster's Big Score. That one I've been looking to, like, forever now. It looks awesome. I really want to play that one. But, um... Yeah, but that's about it for this, I think. Uh, I guess I don't really have much else to add. Oh, you know, we like Sage here in chat. Yeah. That's it. Thank you, everyone, for coming out. I'll probably be live tomorrow, actually. Um, I'm thinking about playing Grapple Dogs Cosmic Canines. Something that may or may not happen. We'll see. But, uh,. Have a good rest of your night. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.